the best and easiest treatment for penis swelling. Hello, I'm getting many men getting in touch with me and sending me emails about asking me questions about what is causing their penis to swell. Now, if you've got a swelling of your penis, whether it's the shaft or the, the gland on the end or your foreskin, stay with this video, I'm gonna show you how to get rid of it, okay? First of all, peace of mind. If you're worried sick, go to the doctors. But the chances are 99.999% it's caused by a fungus. And many men, in fact most men, suffer from fungus of the genitals, the penis and the scrotum and the backside from time to time. So you're normal. Anyway, how do you get rid of it? It doesn't matter whether it's the end. Let me show you. Say if we use this banana as your penis, it doesn't matter if it's the end where the foreskin is swollen or the gland, the bell at the end is swollen, it's called balanitis. They give it all kinds of fancy names, but it's fungus growing on your penis, eating the skin of your penis, your body is reacting to it, increasing the blood flow, trying to get rid of it, and then it swells, and that's what you've got, okay? Very simple and easy to get rid of. Some men have swelling of the penis down the shaft. Some have swelling of the, the skin on the testicles. It becomes inflamed. And then it can also, whilst we're on the subject, it can also affect between your legs and around your backside. But specifically, how do you get rid of the, this inflammation or this swelling on your penis? So understand this, that you're covered in fungus. Everywhere, your eyes, your ears, your mouth, and your penis. Now normally your immune system will defend you. It will eat or kill that fungus and it's going on all the time, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and you never notice. But if the fungus starts, but, but if an outside species of fungus starts to win the battle, as it were, it starts to eat the skin of your penis, of your foreskin, of your gland, of your shaft, then you need to kill it, to kill this outside fungus. But how do you do it? Now, if you go to the doctors, I guarantee, if you go to the doctors or the drugstore, they will give you a drug that appears to make things better. And this is the stuff they're going to give you. It's, this is just a brand, but it's a drug that ends in those letters there. A-Z-O-L-E or A-Z-O-L-E. Fluconazole, cryptazole, all kinds of fluconazole here. These drugs will kill the fungus throughout your body. But it's like killing the army in your body. The army that's there to defend you, this drug will kill it. And it'll kill the other fungus as well. So it appears like you've got better. Your swelling of your penis will go down. The swelling of your foreskin will go down for two, three, maybe even four weeks. And you think, fantastic, it's all gone. Well, it hasn't, because after about five or six weeks, remember, you've just killed off part of your immune system. You've just killed off your own army with this drug. And it doesn't matter whether you use the capsule or you use the cream, it's the same drug. So after five or six weeks, there's nothing there to protect your penis. There's nothing there to protect your testicles or your backside. So the outside fungus, like weeds in your garden, they just come straight back in again. Only this time there's nothing to protect you, so you're in a worse position than ever if you use an azole drug. So what do you do? Well, I've been looking at this problem for over 20 years, and literally 15 years ago, we did a lot of research with plant extracts. There are natural plant extracts which will kill the fungus on contact, literally. Now, in this bottle here, there's a bottle of clear liquid, like an oil say if that was your penis you just put it on on the foreskin on the gland at the end it's a clear liquid it kills the fungus on contact and it doesn't harm your immune system you're not taking it in you're not sending it throughout your body you're just putting it where you need it clear liquid put it on three times a day within three days 
your fungus problem will have gone. So if you've got balanitis or a, a swollen foreskin or a swollen gland, a red end on the end, if your shaft is, if the skin is cracked, is red or you've got dry flaky skin, because sometimes this fungus can cause it to go white with white spots or red with red spots depending on the type of fungus. In here is a blend of four plant extracts and four homeopathic treatments designed to kill off the fungus on contact. Very simple, you've seen how simple it is to use. Literally, there's a drop on the end of the finger and you apply it three times a day and that is it. It doesn't damage your immune system. It'll be gone certainly, even in a bad case, it's gone within a week. Okay. Now below this video, you can find out more about these, this natural remedy which will sort out your penis skin problem. Below this video, just click the link and have a look at it. It's guaranteed to work. Do not use strong drugs. You're going to cause problems for yourself down the line. Just keep it natural. It's still very strong. Natural stuff is still very strong. Okay, but you don't have to stick it in your mouth and destroy your immune system. Just use the natural plant extracts. If you are interested in it, click the link below the video. We'll get it sent out to you today. You'll have it in a day or two. Get it on your penis. After that, after about a week, definitely after a week, the problem's gone. Use this remedy once a week. Just keep it in the bathroom when you've had a shower. Apply it to your penis once a week just to stop any fungus from ever coming back. I'll say that again. There's no problem getting rid of the inflammation and the swollen penis and the swollen skin. No problem. Once it has gone, you don't want it coming back. So use this remedy just once a week and it'll kill off any fungus. And that's it. So click the link below the video. Again, if there's any questions, get in touch. And we'd love to hear from you or give us a ring, whatever. Get in touch through the website. All right, bye for now.